Hello, in this session, we will look at an introduction to Terraform meta arguments. Now, Terraform meta arguments can be used whenever you want to customize the behavior of your resources or the behavior of your modules within your Terraform configuration code. We can make use of your Terraform meta arguments. Like, for example, let's say uh, you want to create multiple uh, uh, instances or you want to control the life cycle of the resources or maybe you want to do a loop that is where we can make use of your terraform meta arguments which will help you to control the uh, resources that we are creating using terraform so these are some special constructs in terraform and we can use this with the resource blocks as well as the module block so these meta arguments you know they are available for us to use either with the resource block or with the uh, module block so these special arguments they allow us to basically control the various aspects of your uh, module or the resources that we are creating such as you know handling the dependencies or setting some configuration uh, custom configuration options all those things can be done using terraform meta arguments so like i said let's say you want to handle some hidden dependencies then we can make use of this meta arguments or you want to customize the configuration options of your resources that you are creating then we can make use of your terraform meta arguments so the uh, terraform it provides below meta arguments that we can use so we have the depends on meta argument now by default terraform will handle the dependencies when we are creating the resources however there might be cases where there are hidden dependencies which your terraform uh, will not be able to handle in that case we can make use of the depends on uh, meta argument to tell terraform to handle those hidden dependencies then we have the count meta argument now the count meta argument can be used to uh, create or manage several similar objects for example let's say you want to launch 10 instances with the same configuration same instance type same ami then we can go with the count meta argument instead of having to write the resource block multiple times then we have the for each meta argument now this also can be used to manage several similar objects however uh, again let's say you want to launch 10 instances but each of these instances you want to use different configuration maybe a different ami or different instance type then we can make use of your for each meta argument then we have the provider meta argument now at any point when we are launching our resources terraform will use the default provider configuration to uh, create our resources however if you want to override that default provider configuration we can make use of the provider meta argument and then lastly we have the life cycle meta argument which can be used to control the life cycle of the resources so maybe you want to um, uh, change the behavior of the life cycle for the resources then we can make use of the life cycle meta argument in the upcoming sessions we will be looking at each of these uh, one by one but basically this is what your uh, terraform meta arguments are so once again at any point if you want to um, control the aspects or control the behavior of your resources or the modules we can make use of your terraform meta arguments that's it for this session thank you once again before you leave please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and if you like the video leave a like and please share the video